Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I am coming at you guys today with a sit down video. It has been a minute since I've been in front of my camera and talking to you guys, but I put some thought into this video and I'm coming back with a video that I filmed a few years ago and it got a good response. So I'm coming back with a new addition to that. And I am calling this video Battle of the Application. So basically what this video is, is I'm going to take two different products, two eyebrow products, and I'm going to apply one to each side of my face. And I will go over um, the likes and dislikes of this product. And I will let you guys know what I did like and what I didn't like. And in the end, I will let you know which product I believe is best. So it's like kind of like a showdown of the products and I got a good response on my last video like this. So I was thinking to myself like, yes, you need to do another video like that because if you guys are liking these type of videos, I want to continue to give you things that you do like. So with that being said, make sure you guys always subscribe and um, comment, interact with me so I'll know what you guys like. I ask this in all of my videos and sometimes I get a good response and sometimes I don't. Even if you didn't like the video, I'm open to constructive criticism. I'm not that type of person. I can handle that. So with that being said, I'm going to jump right into this video and I hope you guys enjoy. All right, so I'm going to first start off with the pencil. Um, so basically on this side, I'm going to be doing pencil. And then on this side, I'm going to be doing a pomade. So regardless if I do pomade or pencil, I always use this like spoolie brush and I brush my eyebrows out. Like I just brush them. I brush them in the direction that I want them to go like this. So let's see. Yeah, I think I want to do this side with the pencil. And this is not the typical pencil that I would use. This is more so like, um, I don't know, it's fatter. Works. So, going in, I'm just outlining underneath. And this part of my eyebrow, the tail, I usually extend it just a little bit. Like that. Then I go on top and I do the same. I'm just outlining. And it's not technically a tutorial. I do have an eyebrow tutorial that I'll link um, in the cards. So this isn't my eyebrow tutorial, but this is just me doing the battle of these two products to see which one is easier to use and which one works better. all I do. So before I do any cleanup, I'm going to go in with the next side. When and I go in with this side, I'm using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Powder, um, what is this called? Dip Brow Pomade. I haven't used this in a while because I have been using a pencil for the convenience. So just prematurely um, picking one, I think I'm going to like the pencil better because I just think it's a lot easier. It's one product and a lot of the pencils nowadays come with this little spoolie thing on the end. So you already have everything you need in one product versus this dip um, powder, dip brow. You usually get a brush that's double sided, but this was like a cheaper brush that I have and my spoolie part has fell off. I really don't know where it's at, but we are gonna work with this. And I haven't used it in a while, so I'm hoping that it's still good. Coated my brush and same process. Outline the eyebrow first. This 
this is kind of an unfair battle because this dip powder, um, like I said, it's kind of old. So it's not the easiest to work with, but because I have worked with this before, I do know that it isn't that hard to work with. So right now, this is the difference. I'm gonna go in with my LA Pro Concealer and Fawn, which is my favorite one to use for my eyebrows. And I'm just gonna outline the outside of them. So guys, this is the eyebrow pencil side and this is the dip brow side. So my eyebrows are a bit different. So this tail, this tail end part right here is a lot thicker than this one is for some reason. But these are the differences. And I want you guys to let me know which side do you think, which side do you prefer? I feel like they're both fairly easy to work with. So both sides were easy to work with. It's just, um, I think this, I have to give this to the eyebrow pencil side. It just seems a little bit more flawless and it does seem a little bit more buffed out. With the dip brow side, I think my eyebrows come out a little more dark and a little harsher than they do when I use a pencil. So let's run down a few of the differences with these eyebrows. So this side again is going to be my eyebrow pencil side and this side is my pomade side. So on the eyebrow pencil side, I believe that it took me a little bit longer than it did with the pomade, but this side is more flawless. Like it's more buffed out it looks more natural the pros of the eyebrow pencil is it's convenient all of the product is in one item and it gives you a more natural finish with the pomade side it is um spreadable and it's easier to work with so it allows you to do your eyebrows a lot quicker but the product is also more like pigmented and it's a lot thicker so you have to work a little bit harder to like buff it out and make it look natural. So um, technically one side does not necessarily take longer, but I do have to give this battle to the eyebrow pencil because it did give me a natural finish like I like, and it has all the products in one. So you don't have to buy like a separate brush or um, anything like that because just the dip brow alone, I believe it's about $20 and then I want to say the brush is in $20 or my but with a Eyebrow pencil you can buy the one pencil for about $20 if you want a high-end brand or you can go to a drugstore and get like a uh, Like a $10 eyebrow pencil or $5. They even have dollar eyebrow pencils. So the variety is there more with the eyebrow pencils as well. So I want to go ahead and give this battle to the eyebrow pencil because it worked the best. So this goes to the eyebrow pencil. Again, I hope you guys enjoy these videos. If you do, Make sure you like this video and comment down below to let me know that you enjoyed it. And until next time, I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.